Hi, and welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this article, Michelle Obama just hit Democrats with some really bad news about 2020. Democrats had no idea what hit them. Many top party officials were counting on Barack and Michelle Obama to help carry the party to victory in 2020. But Michelle Obama just hit Democrats with some really bad news about 2020. Barack and Michelle Obama appeared at the Obama Foundation Festival in Illinois. Their public appearances and comments attract intense media scrutiny because everyone wants them to attack Donald Trump or announce that Michelle Obama is entering the 2020 presidential contest. This time, Michelle Obama's comments attracted attention for all the wrong reasons. The former first lady launched into a tirade where Obama ranted and raved that all white people were racist and didn't want to live around racial minorities. But unbeknownst to us, we grew up in the period, as I write, called white flight. That as families like ours, upstanding families like ours, as we moved in, white folks moved out because they were afraid of what our families represented, Obama raged. Obama then roared that whites were hypocritical bigots that talked a good game about family values but rejected Michelle Obama's model family because of seething hatred for their skin color. And I always stop there when I talk about this out in the world because, you know, I want to remind white folks that y'all were running from us. This family with all the values that you've read about. You were running from us. And you're still running because we're no different than the immigrant families that are moving in. The families that are coming from other places to try to do better. Obama then sneered that she couldn't re-educate the racism out of whites, claiming she can't make people not afraid of black people. I can't explain what's happening in your head, but maybe if I show up every day as a human, a good human, maybe, just maybe, that work will pick away at the scabs of your discrimination," Obama added. The left's obsession with identity politics towards the end of Barack Obama's presidency helped fuel Donald Trump's rise. Liberals assigned value to individuals and their ability to speak based on their race, gender, or if they claimed to be homosexual or transsexual. Michelle Obama expressed that type of rhetoric on steroids in her comments. Observers were shocked that a former first lady would launch into a racist tirade and generalize negative characteristics to a group of people solely based on their skin color. That is the dictionary definition of racism. And it's bad news for the Democrats as the party heads into the 2020 election. To win back the White House, Democrats need to win back working class votes, many of the white in the industrial Midwest. Obama's racist comments about white people fuels the perception that Democrats won't engage in good faith dialogue with anyone that won't accept their socialist platform 100%. Instead, anyone that disagrees with any Democrat policy priority is a racist and suffers from white privilege and must therefore be punished.